Hi guys, Sal here with another unboxing or review, whichever way you want to see it. And today we have a special treat. We have Faces of Adele and I already bought her extra bodies. So let's go ahead and talk about the specifics. Um, she retails for $190 plus you have the option of buying those completing bodies that are $30 for both. That's what you paid. And... I actually had the addition of one, no, 850 out of 1180. So it is a rather large addition size. Uh, gorgeous nonetheless. So let me go ahead and debox it and let's talk specifics. Hi guys, I'm back and right now we're going to talk about Adele 1.0. And as you can tell, her makeup's a little on the heavier side but it's still very beautiful and very well done. I love the flocked hair. The makeup's a little bit heavy for my personal taste, but like I said, it's very well done and it's very tasteful and it's pretty. And now we have the dress. Um, the dress is hot pink. I am personally not a fan of hot pink. However, I do have to appreciate that the dress is very well constructed, very well made, and the quality is really good. Um, it's lined and it's high quality fabric. I can tell because I buy a lot of fabric. I, if it was white maybe, then I would maybe keep it, but I'm just not personal. Personally, I'm just not a fan of hot pink, but like I said, that's just my personal taste. I still think it's a beautiful dress. And here we have the shoes. The shoes, even though I'm not a big fan of hot pink on clothes, I do love it on accessories. So the shoes are a must for me, especially because they have that gold detail and I love gold. So I love, love, love the shoes. Here we have the bra and the bra. Well, it's more like a bralette. And this was one of the extra pieces that came with the dolls. I think it came with the 3.0 sculpt that we'll talk about in a minute and it does come with the extra hands to be able to carry purses this gift set didn't come with purses but it did come with a lot of other stuff so i think it's only fair for the price and everything that you know it didn't come with bags i mean when you have so many cool shoes who cares and here we have the jewelry and it is sun inspired uh, it's very beautiful. I love the detail on the earrings and let me turn this ring for you. Oh, it's actually a bracelet, I believe. It's a matching bracelet to go with those um, stunning earrings and I love, love the jewelry. I love the hoop earrings. They're very tasteful. I love the ring in the middle and I love the bracelet. It's gold toned. It's not actual gold, but you know, it is a doll. And Another detail that I wanted to talk about was um, the sole on the shoes, the black shoes, the classics, is pink and I think that's something new that they did because I don't think I had ever seen pink soles on a shoe before. Yeah. And then you have the dress and it's like a light, I want to say it's like satin, but not really, or organza. It's a very delicate fabric and it's very see-through but the dress does come, does come with like a structure under it that you know covers her up and I do want to say that this is the first time that they've done dolls with blushing on the nipples. I'm not going to post that on here or Instagram because I don't, I don't want to get my accounts flagged but you can google if you want to see that in detail. Yeah. And here we have Adele 3.0. Again, her makeup's a little on the heavier side. And that's just my personal taste. Doesn't mean she's not beautiful because she is beautiful. It's just different. And I do, however, love the curly hair. It's very cool. It's very Donna Summer. Yeah, it's, it's gorgeous. And here we have the amazing and gorgeous Adele 2.0. And actually, I really do think that <laughs> all Adele's should be 2.0 because her face is like so stunning and so flawless. And yeah, they should always be Adele 2.0 because 
honestly, this is the reason that I bought the gift set, and I think she's just so stunning and gorgeous. I love the detail on the lingerie. I loved the netting on this high-waisted undie. It's, it's so gorgeous. Unfortunately, <laughs> they, they sent me two arms that are the same arm, so I do have to talk to patient care and get that situation fixed. But Integrity Toys patient care is really useful, so hopefully they'll be taken care of. And another reason that I bought the gift set was like this stunning boots. They're so gorgeous. They're more of a stretchy material. Um, it's not really a fabric that I'm familiar with, but so far I like it. It's really flexible, so she'll be able to sit down and stuff. So, yeah. Um, the stand is like... It's like a stand with a regular um, traditional stand on the left side. And then you have the option to sit the busts that come with the heads on the middle and right. Little, you see that little stick right there? You're supposed to put the bust in there. But that was a little too, like, <laughs> too much for me to display them that way. So I decided to just, like, display them like so. And I think they look really cool. Yeah, what do you guys think? Um, so if you like my review, go ahead and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram. Remember that I also do reviews in Spanish. So the Spanish version should be up there. And thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you liked my video, and I hope that it was useful for you in making your decision of whether you should get the stalls or not. Thank you for watching. Bye.